ladies and gentlemen, you know my first guest tonight from The Wire, Luther, and The Avengers movies. His latest is Fast and Furious presents Hobbs and Shaw. What's the problem, boys? Is it hard? Must be hard being so human. Please welcome Idris Elba. Come on and let the good time roll. We're gonna stay here till we soothe our souls. Take all night long. Come on and let the good time roll. We're gonna stay here till we soothe our souls. Take all night long. Thank you. <laughs> wow. A, a, a standing ovation. I can't believe That's it. That's right. Not everybody gets that. I Thanks so much it. for being here. No, thank you for having me, man. How was your summer so far? Are you a busy man, uh, you know, talking about this movie? Or have you had any chance to just sort of have fun? No fun. No fun whatsoever. No. no. <laughs> just work. Uh, it's been busy. Uh, yeah. I, I DJ as well as uh, act every now and again. Really? John so. and I were talking about that uh, before the show. He said yeah. you're a good DJ. Oh, thank you. Thank yeah, you, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I, I do my thing. I'm doing a residency at High in Ibiza every Friday at the moment. So uh, Every Friday yeah. you fly to Ibiza yeah, to DJ. Yeah, it crazy. sucks being Idris it Elba. Sucks. Is what it sucks. Who wow. wants to do that? Um, so I'm always tired, yep. and yeah, but I had a great summer. So. Well, you don't look tired in this clip. When, when, you, when, you, when you signed up, was, did you think it was going to be fun or daunting to do that much action in this movie? Uh, it was going to be daunting because uh, the director, David Leach, he loves, you know, he did John Wick. He has these really big sequences. He's a former Highly stuntman. choreographed. Yeah, highly yeah exactly. It was also going to be daunting because I was going to be working with Dwayne and Jason, you know, mm -hmm. uh, both. Who's more daunting between the two of those? The idea that I'm going to be in these fight scenes with, uh, with uh, Dwayne, the Dwayne Johnson, or Jason <laughs> Statham? Uh, it's Jason. Really? Yeah, he's just, like, wiry. <laughs> you know, The Rock's kind of like, give me a hug, bro. You don't want to fight. <laughs> Come on, bring he it is. in. He is. He is a, a big, lovable like teddy bear is what he, he is. is. He is. Now, you are, um, this is, this is a, a serious and personal subject, if you don't mind me asking, but we like to get at a deep subject sometimes on the show. Yes. You are currently uh, the reigning sexiest <laughs> man alive. Yeah. And I believe. It's really, it's so weird, because, like, uh, as soon as someone mentions it, my eyebrows do this weird thing where it's like, yeah. <laughs> it never happened before. Can't help it. Can't help it. <laughs> now, you will be uh, officially the sexiest man alive. It's for one year. This goes until November. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yes? It says alive. <laughs> yes? So, as long as I'm alive. <laughs> well. <laughs> hey, here's the thing, is that your co-star, Dwayne Johnson, was the sexiest man alive in 2016. So how can there be two sexiest men alive? It's like the Highlander. There yeah. can be only one. <laughs> no, Dwayne hasn't let it go. He hasn't? It's, it's nope. sad. It's sad. What are the responsibilities? <laughs> what are the, some of the responsibilities of being the sexiest man uh, alive? Well, for in that year where you are allotted the sexiest man, the idea is to, you know, be sexy, do sexy things. <laughs> Say, uh, go to Ibiza every Friday to DJ. Know. That's one of them. Um, I got married this year. Oh, congratulations. Thank you. That's a sexy thing to do. Yes. Yes. To my, to my beautiful wife, Van, and that was considered a sexy thing to do, so... Sure. Yeah. Hopefully she finds you sexy, and so <laughs> that, that helps seal the she deal. She does. She loves it when I do this. <laughs> Can we get a close-up? They can't quite see what you're doing. Let's get a close up on three because it's real. It is sexy. Okay, here we go. Ready? This is normal. Say sexy. Say sexy. Sexiest man alive. <laughs> it's just, it just happens. Right? <laughs> you do it a little bit too, Stephen. What? You, well... <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> There's another film you're in that ev everybody is obsessed with right now, and it's Cats. Oh, yeah. You, uh, you play, what's the name of your character? In uh, McCavity. McCavity, okay. McCavity. And the, it, here, we got a picture here. The internet is all buzz with, with the trailer, which came out last week. And, and here you are as McCavity. You see me? Right there. Hey. Okay. And wow. is that all of that digital? Are you wearing any of the out? Is like a like a, a suit with ping pong balls on it? And they <laughs> add all the fur, or is there any prosthetic work the, involved? The, the fur coat is mine. I mean, yes. literally mine. And uh, and the hat is real. The ears aren't real. The eyes are real. I had to wear these uh, incredible contact contacts. Contacts. Yeah. But the rest is you know the wonderful magic of movie making. Yeah. Um, Can I tell you though, when I was working on Hobbs and Shaw. Just after that, I went to work on Cats. So I'm working with Dwayne and Jason. Yeah. And they're like, as soon as they found out I was working on Cats, this was their favorite thing to do as I walked on set. We're doing this big fight scene. I'm walking in, looking all bravado. And they were like, hey, just what are you doing next? <laughs> <laughs> and the crew would be like, what are you doing next? I'm like, <clears throat> Cats. <laughs> I don't know, Hobbs and Shaw, Fast and the Furious, Cats. It just... Now, I have never seen Cats. Um, can you tell me or explain to me what the plot of Cats is? Oh, <laughs> uh, wow. Uh, what a way to throw me under the bus there. Yes. No, it's, uh, it's a classic. It's a big musical. Sure, I'm Andrew, with that. Andrew Lord Webber. Right. And it is, a, it's, uh, I guess it's about a, a, a cat. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Maybe how, more than one. How Maybe am I doing? How am I doing? Very okay. good. And it's one cat's journey towards what is essentially cat heaven. Okay? Oh, okay. And the idea is that we all, you know, we aspire to get towards cat heaven. There's this young cat, and she gets sort of, you know, taken on this story about how to get to cat heaven or what you should do to get into cat heaven. How am I doing? Does anyone know what the story is? <laughs> that is the best explanation of the plot of cats I have ever heard. <laughs> I understand you went to cat school. Yes. What is cat school? Okay, so, so cat school, uh, so Tom Hooper, who, who directed it, uh, amazing director, did Les Mis, he's very detailed. He wanted the actors to really embody the feline, you know, persona, the vibe. Yep. And so he uh, instructed this lovely lady, her name was Sarah, I think, and she was a cat expert. In fact, not only was she a cat expert, but she was also an expert at how humans should play cats. Uh, that's a job? That's... <laughs> <laughs> she's, she's been waiting forever for this movie to be made. <laughs> come on, come on. Come on, I've wasted my life. I've wasted my life. Come on. So what did she teach you? Could you, uh, I would, would yeah, I mean, it, how does a cat, how does a human walk as a cat? Okay. Could so, you teach me? Uh, yes. Yes. <laughs> well. <laughs> No, see, see, you, you've got it all wrong. You've got, you've got it okay, all what wrong. Do I, what are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? So first of all, she really spoke to us about the anatomy of a cat. We had to understand the bones, the structure, how the, the hips and everything work and all that. And then, so what you realize is all about the shoulders. You know, you go, oh, you see, you know. And cats, you know. Oh, ooh, you're doing a little diddy bop there, that's it. So, uh, but the thing is, you know, cats prowl, they sort of prowl, so it's one shoulder in front of the other, and it's a bit of that, yeah. And then, yeah, there you go. And then she would say to you, what's that noise? <laughs> Real. You, I don't know. You, you know. I don't know if you're a great teacher or if I'm a genius. <laughs> I can't what? tell between the two of those. You're a cool cat. See what wow. I did there? <laughs> well, Idris, so nice to have hey, you. Man, Thank you for being here. Fast and presents Hobbs and Shaw is in theaters this Friday. Idris Elba, everybody. We'll be right back.